What's up, y'all? This is Rebel Life Boxing. Um, yeah, I want to make a quick video, right? And this is about the Canelo fanboys again. I got a, I got a question for the Canelo, the Canelo fanboys, yo. Cause look, like I'm looking around, seeing comments on videos, and you know they mad at Billy Joe Sanders because he demanded a bigger ring, and they like who? He ain't the A side. He shouldn't demand a bigger ring. I get that. I agree. You're a boxer. Do what you do. But at the same time, you got to apply that same shit to Canelo. Because why is Canelo demanding a smaller ring? Hmm? Why, why is he commanding a smaller ring if he's such a skilled, a skilled fighter? It don't matter if you A side or B side, right? It don't matter if you A side or B side. You the man. You you got confidence and skill. You got confidence in your ability. You don't need a smaller ring, right? He been he been doing good, right? He been knocking people out and beating running through his opponents. So why do you need a smaller ring? Why can't it be a standard size ring? If you're gonna say, well, Billy Joe should be confident enough in his in his skill to move around the ring, even if it's a smaller ring. Shouldn't that same thing apply to Canelo when it comes to him wanting a wanting a, wanting a um, smaller ring? The same way it should it applies to Billy Joe wanting a bigger ring, right? See, the mindset of these Canelo fanboys never seems fails to amaze me, bro. They're so one-sided with everything that they don't even see that. They, well, when Floyd Mayweather, you know, he was the A side, he made all the rules. Okay, but we're not talking about Floyd right now. We're talking about Canelo, Saul, Canelo, Cinnamon, Alvarez. That's what we're talking about. We're not talking about Floyd Mayweather. We're talking about Canelo Alvarez. Supposed to be pound for pound best and all of that. But you requesting a smaller ring to prevent another fighter from moving around because you got problems with fighters that move around. You had, and I mean, that's documented. He had issues with Austin Trout. Definitely had issues with Arislandi Lara, which was a very close fight. He don't, he don't want to go through that kind of hell again. Show me, after he fought those two, any other movers that was on the same level of Lara and Austin Trout. He had some issues with Floyd Mayweather, too, but he had most... Most of his issues was with Arizona Lara, man. I don't buy it, bro. I'm not, I'm not giving Canelo... No, you gotta stop giving that motherfucker passes, bro. Because... This is supposed to be the champ, right? He's the greatest this and that. All right, why are you requesting a smaller ring? Yo, get in there and knock him the fuck out or take his belt. Do whatever you're going to do. Decision, knockout. It shouldn't matter if it's a smaller ring, right? You you the man. You you know how to fight, Canelo. All right. I just had to say that because these fucking, um, these Canelo fucking fanboys, bro. I mean, bro, they just... All over the place against they like Billy Joe. He ain't got no right to run and request it. They mad because the ring is bigger than what I think the ring is bigger than what Canelo asked for. I'm pretty sure what well, it's supposed to be 18 feet, 18 square feet. I think it's bigger than that. It's not what Billy Joe wanted, but it's like better than what Canelo is better than what um is more than what Canelo uh, initially asked for, I believe. So they mad at that shit because I think Billy Joe Sanders. Might be one of the, I mean, he's not the biggest puncher. He's not even the uh, the best mover out of out of Laura and Trout, but he is the next best fighter that has the movability that he's fought at Canelo's for a long time. And maybe that's worrying a lot of these uh, fanboys. Maybe that's getting a lot of them uh, upset. But hey, listen, this is boxing. Let it play out how it's gonna play out. Either Canelo gonna win or Billy Joe Saunders gonna win. Can't go around that. Somebody gonna lose their belt on um, Saturday, so we'll see who it is. It's Rebel Life Boxing, man. Let me know what you think. I'll catch y'all later on the next one. Like and subscribe. Support the channel. I'll let y'all.